Proxima b is one of the most fascinating exoplanets recently discovered. It's in a celestial body that, by cosmic terms, is right next door to us. Many new and fascinating facts about the planet have been discovered since its detection, including the potential that it is an oceanic world, and where there is water, there may be life. Astronomers have discovered a huge and rising number of Earth-sized exoplanets circling distant stars in recent years. Some are in their stars' habitable zones, where temperatures may enable liquid water to exist on their surfaces. However, astronomers were particularly delighted by Proxima Centauri b, since the Sun it circles is the nearest star to our Sun, barely 4.2 light-years away. Willem Anglada Escude and a team of astronomers from the Pale Red Dot Initiative discovered Proxima b. As stated, Alpha Centauri is 4.2 light-years away from Earth. This may appear to be far away, yet it is three times nearer than the next Sun-like star. The third biggest star in our sky is part of a triple star system that includes the binary star pairings Alpha Centauri A and B, as well as Alpha Centauri C, also known as Proxima Centauri. The two star partners, Alpha Centauri A and B, are only around 23 astronomical units apart, which is rather nearby by cosmic standards. In contrast, the distance between the Sun and Uranus is around 19.8 astronomical units. Its presence was verified using the ESO 3.6 meter telescope's High Accuracy Radial Velocity Planet Searcher, or HARPS, spectrograph, using a practice called Doppler spectroscopy, or the radial velocity method. This approach involves monitoring the spectra of stars for evidence of wobble, which occurs as a star moves closer and further away from a planet. This is created by the gravitational impact of planets orbiting the star, the extent of which is used to calculate the planet's masses. Astronomers derived a lower mass guesstimate of 1.24 Earth masses and a maximum mass estimate of 2.06 Earth masses for Proxima b. The transit approach was used to discover the majority of exoplanets identified to date. However, for a star like Proxima Centauri, a low mass and less luminous M-type or red dwarf star, the method proved ineffective. With a mass of 1.17 Earths, Proxima Centauri b is quite comparable in size to Earth. In comparison to our Earth's year-long orbit around the Sun, it circles its star in just 11.2 days. That implies that Proxima Centauri b is far closer to its star than Earth is to the Sun. However, because the star is a red dwarf, which is considerably smaller and colder than our Sun, its orbit falls within Proxima Centauri's habitable zone. Proxima Centauri b, interestingly, receives almost the same amount of solar radiation from its star as Earth does from our Sun. This means that water may exist on the surface of Proxima Centauri b. It might be livable, but we don't yet know all the intricacies concerning exo-world habitability. However, several elements influence a planet's habitability, including temperature, the makeup of the planet's atmosphere, the presence or absence of water, and solar radiation. But here's the intriguing part. Proxima Centauri is a red dwarf star, which means it's not as hot and doesn't release as much heat as our Sun. So, the fact that Proxima b is 20 times closer to its host star than Earth is to the Sun is inconsequential. In brief, the distance of Proxima b from its host star is good enough to be counted in the habitable zone. It doesn't get too hot or too cold, which means that water can exist there in its liquid state. As we all know, water is the source of all life. So, is this to say that Proxima b hosts life? Well, 
it may be too soon to say. Proxima Centauri's behavior is chaotic and unpredictable. It has been discovered to be unstable in terms of the light intensity that it puts out. It changes its brightness very frequently. In 2017, scientists studying the star witnessed a sudden burst of heat 1,000 times hotter than before, lasting up to 10 seconds. There would be no life left on Earth if that had happened to our Sun. So, that 10-second outburst could have exterminated all life on Proxima b, if there was any to begin with. Not to mention, Proxima b receives 400 times more X-rays than Earth, which are not for complex living entities to survive. But what about the strange signals that seem to be artificial signals scientists have received from Proxima b in 2019? This brings us to another intriguing fact. Proxima b is so close to Proxima Centauri that it is gravitationally bound to it, that is, only one side of it is exposed to the host star. Scientists speculate that there could be an advanced civilization existing on the other side of the planet that is not subject to the host star's quick brightness change. This civilization might also have sent these signals, which are thought to be either artificial or of terrestrial origin. Scientists describe the signals as a bright, long-duration optical flare accompanied by a series of intense, coherent radio bursts. The signals were detected by an Earth-based telescope for 30 days straight, and when the telescope's direction was changed away from Proxima b, the signals stopped coming. So it is certain that these signals were coming from Proxima b or one of the moons orbiting. Some believe the signals were caused by interference from Earth's technology, while others believe they were sent by intelligent people from the exoplanet. This is where the James Webb Telescope comes in handy. It might reveal whether or not Proxima b has civilization. If Proxima b's atmosphere is habitable, it will absorb light from the star and re-emit it as infrared radiation. Although the James Webb Telescope cannot look deeply into exoplanets, it can monitor infrared light emitted by Proxima b's atmosphere. The telescope can photograph infrared light on Proxima b's surface, looking for patterns that might indicate whether or not this exoplanet has water or an atmosphere. But it isn't as simple as it sounds. There are other aspects to consider, such as the fact that a habitable environment does not always ensure the existence of life. A similar argument was made by Princeton University astronomer Ed Turner, leaving us to speculate whether Proxima b could be Earth next door or not. To look deeper into Proxima b, we would require space probes, which as I previously said would take longer than the average lifespan of a human civilization to reach Proxima b. But don't worry, scientists are working on developing space probes as light as a needle and the size of a kite that could travel to their destination in just 21 years. What do you think about the existence of aliens on Proxima b? Let us know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this one. Turn on the notification icon to get notified of all new activities on the channel. See you in the next video!